This tutorial will give you a short overview about the layout of the Digital Jockey 2. The mixer section is positioned in the middle and is similar to a normal DJ mixer. So crossfader, two line faders, threefold EQ with kill function and two gain knobs. The cue buttons for pre-listening tracks are positioned left and right next to the gains. You will find the master and browse section at the top. Firstly you'll notice the large tracks encoder, with that you can navigate at ease through your music library. The low track buttons are positioned left and right next to the tracks encoder. You will find the master volume, cue volume and cue mix knob below. Let's move to the jog wheel and transport section. Two extra large jog wheels, which are even touch sensitive in the interface edition, let you scratch, pitch bend, search or modulate effects on the fly. You can choose the mode with these buttons. The transport section with play pause, cue and cup, so cue and play, are positioned right on the jog wheel for fast access. The tempo section is placed at the edge, holding a precise pitch fader, pitch bend buttons, a key lock and sync function for your control. The loop section is positioned below the gain knob, giving you the possibility of setting manual or auto beat loops. Also very handy is the effect section, which gives you four push encoders and buttons for ultimate effect control. In this tutorial, I would like to demonstrate to you which possibility you have of browsing with your Digital Jockey 2. In normal mode, turning the tracks encoder lets you browse through the tracks list. Pushing the load A B buttons lets you load a track into deck A or B. Tractor Pro users can load tracks into deck C and D through holding the shift button and pressing the load buttons. Holding the shift button and turning the tracks encoder lets you navigate through the tree list, so your folder structure. To open and close folders, hold shift and press the pitch bend buttons. But we also have implemented a larger browse mode for even faster searching. To engage the browse mode, press the tracks encoder. You will notice that the library maximizes. In this mode, turning the left jog wheel lets you navigate through the tree list and the right jog through the track list. Also here pitch bend buttons let you open and close folders. To exit the browse mode, simply push the tracks encoder again.